You are about to watch a simulation video of Unit 1. This unit is about understanding the concepts of compassion and presence at end of life care. Hello, I'm here to your admission. Sorry, love. Who are you? I'm obviously one of the nurses working here. Oh, okay. Uh, nice to meet you. So there's a few things I need to check. You are Mary Murphy and you're 65 years of age. And I assume this is your son, your next of kin. Uh, yes, my name's Mary and this is John, my son. Oh, m maybe you should go on. And uh, you have a cancer diagnosis and you're here for your first set of treatments. I, I suppose, yes. Cancer? Mummy, you never told me you had cancer. Oh, it's, it's, it's okay. Hey, mummy, John. no, what do you mean no, you have no, cancer, it's, it's Mummy? It's okay, son. Well, mummy, you can't have... Uh, everything will be fine. You never said you had cancer, everything Mummy. Everything will be fine. Well, that's not fair, it, Mummy. Well, now, Mr Murphy, fine, Mr Murphy, you need to sit down and calm down or we will have to put you out. Maybe you could wait outside. I'm sure there's somewhere to sit and get a cup of tea or a bun. Yeah. Nurse, um, John doesn't know everything. He has some mental health issues, so he needs time to adjust to what's happening with me. That's fine. But he's of no concern to me. You're my concern. He's going to be fine. So I'm going to sort out this identity bracelet and put it on you. And I'm going to check and see where this doctor is so that I can set you up on your first set of treatments. Because I'm going off duty now in the next 15 minutes, so I need to get this sorted. Please just steady your hand here. I'm going to put this identity band on. Okay. okay. Please, Please stay miss. steady, Mrs Murphy. Please. Okay. Now. <laughs> John! John! So now you're after seeing a scenario where a nurse has come to take my admission. This is the first nurse I've come across since I have arrived in hospital. So what I want you to do is to rate this nurse's level of compassion towards me as a patient uh, the first time that she has seen me. Hello oh, Mary, how are you? How are you keeping? Good hi guys, how are you? Hello, how are you? So hello, my name is Adam. Uh, I'm the nurse on the ward today and I'll be looking after you. Uh, and tell me, what's your name or what would you like to be addressed as while you're here? Oh, well, my name is Mary and you can call me Mary. <laughs> and this is my son, John. Well, hello, Mary. Call Mary. <laughs> <laughs> hello, John. Nice to meet you, nurse. And, hello. and tell me, what brings you here today, Mary? Well, uh, Adam, is it? Yeah. Well, well Adam, I... I haven't been well for, for a few weeks. And when I went to my GP, he sent me for a few tests. And the, the results came back saying I had a bit of cancer. But it wasn't too bad and it would respond to treatment. OK, OK. Well, well, we'll see what we can do today. Jo John, would you maybe like to go outside, just take a break and just get a cup of tea or something like that? Oh, maybe, John, you could get us both a cup of tea and a bar. I'll have a purple snack. Is that okay, son? Okay, mummy. Will I get the yellow ones if the purple ones aren't there? Oh, do, son. Thanks. Okay. Okay, Mary. Mary, you are right. The only thing we fight about is the colour of the snacks. <laughs> I need to tell you that John has some mental health issues and he needs time to process information. So he only knows a little bit about what's going on with me. Okay. And 
he lives with me and he's totally dependent on me, like I am on him, believe it or not. Um, his father died a few years back and I, I'm, I'm just worried about what will happen to him if I don't get better. Okay, okay. Well, well, I understand. And what I'll do is I'll make sure to notify John of how you're doing and make sure to keep him updates. But I'll run that by you first. Okay. Yeah, and I'll make sure that John has counselling and that he has a liaison officer. Does that sound okay? Well, thank you. I have to make sure John will be looked after. And, and tell me, Mary, just let's talk about you now. John, there he is. Oh, good man. You got it. <laughs> you, you found it all okay? Is, is one of them for me? Yeah. Thanks, son. Adam might have one. Thanks, John. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, is, thanks, is that John. Me? Thank you. Oh, thanks, son. They didn't have the purple Eleven. one. Now you've seen another scenario with another nurse called Adam. And what I want you to do is to rate his level of compassion towards me as the patient on a scale perhaps of one to five. How do you feel he treated me as a patient and as a human being? <laughs>